Yes. Yes, sir. Yeah. Sir. Yeah. We good? Get into character. Ready? Yes, sir. Do that. Hi, my name is Tony Pazanski. Today we're going to shoot the Brazilian necktie. Travis, thank you for helping me out. Thank you, sir. This is not the Peruvian necktie. It's not the Japanese necktie. It is the Brazilian necktie. Let's get started. Okay, Travis, lay down, please. First, we're going to, I'm going to show a couple moves that are, I think, prerequisites in the learning process. A move that's, uh, I call it the 96 choke. It's when you have your hand in the collar here, thumb in the collar, and the person tries to escape to the side, you move into Kaspatami. From here, you're going to step over the head here. And now from here, you can squeeze the neck. All right? You, your leg goes down, pulling up on the lapel. It's the 96 show. I learned in 1996, and uh, it's very effective. That's the first thing. Second, a lot of times when you're in the, the side control, you, you open up the lapel and feed it to the collar for a good shoulder trap. This can make the transition to a Bravo grip where you take the, the sleeve and the lapel and feed the hand right here so you get into the grip. Can we get that transition? Thank you. Now from here I can go on the attack. Collar choke, if he defends with this hand, I can pull it across, I get into the Bravo style choke. If he defends with this hand, that's an arm lock waiting to happen, the near side. So that's very important, cool. It's very important in the match. However, when you make this transition, sometimes it's difficult. This person's gonna be fighting to the death to stop the second hand transition. So this is where the Brazilian necktie comes into play. So the Brazilian necktie, or you can do it during the competition when you're tired. The originally, I fell into this when the person started to push me away. So it was just the, the right thing to do, and uh, no one has ever taught me that move. I haven't seen it in over 19 years. All the old judo manuals, the old VHS tapes, the different instructors and people that you've, you've met along the way, it just didn't happen. So I coined the phrase, the Brazilian necktie. Put this into your repertoire, and um, you're going to have a higher level of success in the finish. I want to do a contest for this. If you from the day of this taping, can hit this in competition at an IBJJF tournament or like a Gracie Worlds or Gracie Nationals, and you can win it in the final at the white belt, the blue belt, purple, brown, or black, and videotape it. Submit it to me, send it to soulfight.net, and I'll give you uh, some free uh, merchandise from soulfight.net, and I'll also work with BJJ Online. I will give you a one year's membership to BJJ Online if you can make this work in competition for you. Layala, what happens when I just want to go train jujitsu? Just fight. No free. No free jiu-jitsu. No, no teacher. For anything. What do they what do they say to me? You say Anderson? No. No. They, what do they what do the boys say to me when I'm on the mat to try to train spar? Help me, help me. Tony, help me. <laughs> come here, come here, teacher. Help, help, help. Fataji? True. Very true.